Jesus has with each and every one of us and every tear that we shed, he shed with us, especially for the families of Sean, Oren and Jim. This was never part of his father's will for us. Will we be unbound, Lord? I have heard the ceasefire. I've heard their statement yesterday. But I think their statement yesterday was beneath contempt. I hope that they have realised what they have done and that they will perpetrate no more murderous acts. I believe what we're seeing happening right throughout the length and breadth of Ireland is a victory, a victory of the human spirit over the, over the evil of terrorism and violence. He denied that he had anything whatsoever to do about it. The first that he knew that it had happened was that when he heard it on the news on Saturday afternoon. In the meantime, he, he said, I want to make it quite clear, of course, he says that I am a Republican. I am a Republican. I'm not denying that, he said, it's part of my being and that it, that's it. But I had nothing whatsoever at personal level, either before or since, to do with this thing that happened in Oma. You brazened it out until a pretty late stage, you know. She was cracking up. See what she ate. The pressure that was building up was, was really quite phenomenal. Uh, when you when you see it reaching the level of, of uh, vigils and marches, and which we understand would have developed and increased as the week went went by, people associated with the real IRA, or at least perceived to be associated with the real IRA, were coming under enormous pressure at their at their places of work. Businesses were being forced to close down. People were being forced to leave their homes. They believed that they and their families were under serious physical threat, uh, and it's, it had certainly reached the level whereby. Both governments, but particularly the Dublin government, were on, are on the brink of bringing in new security measures, which would have been specifically directed at the real IRA with the full intention of arresting them and ensuring that they spent a, a, lengthy, a lengthy period, possibly most of the rest of their lives, behind bars. 